What is going on guys, it's SJ Sports and welcome back to your Camera Region Series 2 episode number 12 now with SFE Frankfurt. Just want to say before we get into this episode, we've done it, we've got over the 4k mark guys. Thank you so much for your support, it really does mean a lot. I've got to say a big thanks to Matt um, aka MGH who put that tweet out and basically within literally seconds he did that tweet, bang we was over the 4k mark and you know from that tweet alone we've probably gained around and about 70 to 80 subscribers so if you have come um, from MGH's tweet and stuff thank you so much for subscribing guys and hopefully you're going to enjoy the content that's on my channel really do appreciate any questions and stuff you'll see my twitter links in the description below feel free to tweet me leave a comment in the comment section because I do try and reply to all the comments I do see all the comments I'll also thumb comments up and stuff like that it's just the way I may am active with my subscribers so get on to this episode then we have um, a scouting update available from Canada so we scout this guy for two months we are going to reject this player we're going to reject this 82 as well um, oh is he is he Jackson Hamill, 65 to 189? You know what? We'll give this guy an opportunity to do the deal, to do the D's. God, can't talk today. Uh, an 81, we'll get rid of him. An 82, we'll get rid of him. An 80, we'll get rid of him. And a 64. So Canada wasn't particularly great. And we also have a monthly scouting update from the United States of America. Brings us back a 66 to an 88. Um, see if we can scan for a further month. Yes, we will do that. So the first game of the episode then is against Brands Vig. I put probably killed that pronunciation you guys know what i'm like with pronunciation uh, your starting lineup then is sudic in goal kaleem evans bullet khalid seculin vilcho bakalos in han niane and sonogo is an all region side so vilcho with the corner then for frankfurt played into the penalty area up goes the headers and oh it's evans late off late off son evans he's laid off to oh, still evans has got it what's going on here here's bakalos Works it out wide to Inhan. Here he is, Inhan will hit it. Good save from the keeper. And oh, we're asking the questions again and we're trying to find our way through this defence and this goalkeeper. So we've got ourselves a free kick. Seculin asks for it. Seculin then's going to shoot from distance. Oh, and it made the goalkeeper work. It was a great effort. The keeper had to tip that past the post. Back lord, in towards in hand, good ball into Sonogo, this is where we like Sonogo, he's got the pace, he's got the power, he's got the agility, he run into the area now, Sonogo to finish it off, oh what a challenge that was, he had to get that spot on and that was an unbelievable challenge to stop us from going 1-0 in front. Pally with the throw, finds Sekulin, Sekulin lays it off, Ramstein, Ramstein plays it out wide, here is Killeen, Killeen keeps the attack alive, plays it to Ramstein, back lord. Here is Niane then. Niane can shoot from distance. He has a go. The keeper saved it. And Bacalords is there to turn it in. It's 1 0. He was onside. The flag stayed down. And we take the lead. It was a good effort from Niane, the goalkeeper, to be fair to him. He should have done a lot better with that shot. Even Niane's shot wasn't the hardest shot. He did well to save it, actually, looking on the replay. And it fell into the path of Bacalords to tap home and to put us 1 0 up. Ball's played in, get there Evans, well done, he's been a vital part of our season, Evans, and here he's over to him, he's got in hand with him to his right hand side, in hand there, we'll play it back to over to him, it's a good ball, over to him, heads it on towards Niane, Niane then, he's got the legs, has he, has a dig, saved by the keeper, well played, Niane is very struggling stamina wise, you could feel the heaviness in his legs then, he was just running onto that ball to strike it, lays it off to Ramstein on as a substitute, Ramstein then let it open up for him, he hits it, Jesus, what a save that was, in go the headers, Comes to in hand with a bicycle kick. And he gets that horribly, horribly wrong and it goes behind. Where Ramstein's fed through in towards in hand on side. Hit it first time, lads. Good save by the keeper. He felt I had to hit that first time because the defender would have probably caught up with him. And here's back of Lords then. Back to in hand. In hand then. Twisting, turning inside the box. He's won us a free kick in a very good position. So Niane then with this free kick. He's going to try and dink it over the wall into the back of the net. And he rattles the bar and it goes behind. A good effort from Niane. There goes the full-time whistle. We have picked up a massive three points in our promotion push into the Bundesliga. It's finished. Frankfurt 1, Brandsweig 0. Next game of the episode then is FSV Frankfurt against um, Ernst Zuckerberg. I probably killed it, but yeah, guys, I do apologise. Uh, still need to get used to the teams that we're playing. You're starting 11 into the same side that beat the team that we played in the last game. Well in by Sekulé. Oh, good ball but in, by uh, Sonogo in towards Inhan. Inhan is the man. Inhan then will hit it. Oh, the keeper fumbles it and they clear the lines. It was a weak shot. Back Lord, Inhan into Sonogo. Come on, in. Come on, Niane. 
It's an all goal line in towards Niane. Niane drinking inside. Niane will hit it. Oh, it's a great save from Manuel, the goalkeeper. Bacalaws then will look to cross towards Sonogo. Oh, he's hit the post. I've got a feeling it's going to be one of them FIFA games where you absolutely destroy the opposition with chance after chance and can't find the net. It's certainly looking like that in the early stages of this game. Evans then looks to play out wide to Inhan. That's a great ball. Inhan then will lose it. But Kalina will look to feed Bacalaws down this right hand side. Bacalaws then will look to jink inside, looks a big couple of markers, he's done really well. Bacalaws has won as a penalty, surely he has. The referee points to the spot, no hesitation by the referee. Great run from Bacalaws and then player does receive a yellow card for that challenge on Bacalaws. So Niane then is going to be our kick taker. Up his steps then, Niane, oh he saved it, oh it's gone in. <laughs> it's gone down as an own goal. Look at the state of that. That is so unfortunate for the goalkeeper. It was a fantastic save by him from the penalty from Niane. And it hit his back of his leg, his calf, and went into the back of the net. It's 1 0 to Frankfurt. Free kick then. It's going to be taken. And oh, Sudic with a great save. Good, strong right hand. In hand. Up towards Sonogo. Sonogo then got the pace and the agility to take it round that defender. Sonogo going forward, he's getting hold of him. He's going to concede a penalty if he's not careful. Great ball in, in hand, and how on earth has he missed that? I think it was a bit of good defending. In hand, will cross it towards over to him, who just heads it. Easy, past the goalkeeper, he came for the ball, and that should be all, on, all important three points in the bag. It's FSV Frankfurt 2, and is about an hour at nil. Here's Ramstein with the throw, then into... De Jong, oh, De Jong goes past that man like he's not there. De Jong will hit it. Oh, unbelievable. Great play from De Jong. There goes the full-time whistle. We pick up another three points and another clean sheet. This time we scored two goals. It's finished FSV Frankfurt what, two. And it's about our nil. We haven't done a squad report in some quite some time now, so just to see how the players are actually improving and such. So we start off with James Sudic, 68. Kaleem, 71, gone up by two. We've got Jordan Evans, 69, gone up by one. Bullet, 66, gone up by one. Khalid, 62, gone up by three. We've got Bacalaws, 72, gone up by one. Danny Vildschut, 74, gone up by three. We've got Ivan Sekulin, 73, gone up by three. We've got Inhan, 64. We've got Niane, 77 now, gone up by two. Just look at some of them stats on there. It's insane. The game physicals is a problem. We've got Barry Sonogo, 71, gone up by three. We've got Ramstein, 71, gone up by one. We've got De Jong, 63, gone up by three. Volan, 56, gone up by one. Overtoom, 72, gone up by three. Espine, 66. Britrov, 68, gone up by two. Omari, 66, gone up by one. Balmer, 66, 61, gone up by one. God, what's up with you, Stu? Uh, this guy is 59, gone up by two. David Nilsson, 61, gone up by one. Uh, Kadira, 73, gone up by three. Uh, this guy's gone up by 58. Uh, Kaffenberger, 61, gone up by one. Toskai, 64, gone up by one. El Toffel, 62, gone up by four. Albrahim, 69, gone up by five. And that does conclude our squad report. Final game then of the episode is FSC Nuremberg against FSV Frankfurt. One change to the side, it's not personnel, it's a different positions. Vilchuk comes into the Niane position and we're going to give Niane a run out in centre midfield. I just feel he will be probably suited better in that position with his ball control, his passing and stuff and his ability to shoot from long distance. Vilchuk can also play cam, so that's the philosophy behind that. Vilchuk then will take this corner kick and it goes towards the big man. Back along, he's put us 1-0 up. That was a great header into the corner of the net. He leaped the highest. He wanted to get his head on that. And Bacalord is proving to be a, a player that's come from underneath the radar. He's been a fantastic servant for the club so far this season. He's done really well. Gets in between the two players there and heads into the corner. The goalkeeper was stood stranded. And we take the lead. It's 1-0. Sekulin tries to play it through. He's got it back at a second attempt, though. He does find his pass. Phil Schutt will find Sonogo. Sonogo looks for the runner. Bacalords inside the area. Bacalords is in there. And oh, Bacalords, mate. Hit the target. You just scored. Oh, it's a great ball over the top. Here's Pan Not Nietzsche. Cross comes in. Oh, thought that was going in. It was a good header. It was happening like Sudi started in slow motion then. The player would have had it covered if it had been on target. So killing into Bacalord, who's lost it in a dangerous area. Then the ball played through, and it's a chance, and they've capitalised from our mistake. Bacalords of all the players. 
wow, I'm very unfortunate. They don't deserve to be to be level. And it was a mistake, and the letters pay that. I was trying to be too clever, too acute by a back of Lords, and it's a good finish into the back of the net. It's 1-1 now. Phil Shot lays it off. Sonogo hits it. Oh, it's a great save from the keeper. Ock into Ox. Laid off to Suzuko. There's too much time, too much space. Well in clean. Suzuko later keeps the ball alive. Here's a goal scorer. It's laid out wide to Bulthis. Come on, boys. Keep it tight. Kalinski lays it off to Conrad. Well, they're going to fucking shoot. I'm just going to pass it around that 18 yard line. Here's Hawk. Cochrane will shoot and score. Oh my god. We've crumbled in the second half. We're 2 1 down now, and it is Hock the goal scorer, the frigging cock. Hock the cock. It was a good finish, to be fair. It was in the near post. It shouldn't have really allowed him to. To be fair to Nuremberg, they did keep the ball alive at the edge of the area. We kind of switched off, and we find ourselves trailing by two goals to one. Go Ramstein into in hand. In hand, there looks to feed in over two. It's perfect way to pass over two. What a save by the feet of the goalkeeper. Well done, Evans. Wins it back for us. Plays it into over two. Over two, and then we'll take a shot. Oh, it just flown over the bar. Well played from over two. He knew exactly what he wanted to do then. Just turn and hit it. It nearly went in. It was a great strike. The goalkeeper was left stranded, and that is not foul over the bar. Second and into Ramstein. Ramstein then the piling bodies forward. We've got a lot of men in the box. Killeen then needs to play a good ball in. That is a great ball in. Towards back of Lords. Oh, what a save by the goalkeeper. Unbelievable stuff. Great goalkeeping. He has kept Nuremberg in this since they went in front. He's produced some good saves. And that was out of the top draw. There goes the full time whistle. We have picked up our first defeat in five. Thanks to that man there, he had an outstanding game. He made some very good saves. It's Nuremberg that take all three points, though. It's finished Nuremberg 2, Frankfurt 1. So, boys, this episode is finally coming to an end. Hope you have enjoyed. If you have, then make sure you smash that like button so you can get it to 100 likes on this episode. As you can see, we are back in the third place. It is a very, very tight league. You see, Nuremberg picked that win was vital for them to push on to try and get into the top three. As you can see, we are not far behind. Behind Paderborn, who are top, Werder Bremen have crept up into second place. Now they've come from under the radar from nowhere. Abinesh Sports, it's going to be a tense end towards the season. Fasten your seatbelts, guys. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you all on my next video. And goodbye.